Honestly, when I saw this at four in the morning, I didn't know whether to laugh or cry. Who is she? Who is she? I'm honestly heartbroken about that. Okay, what is my favorite Cardi B song? That's a hard one, actually. Comment down below what your favorite Cardi B song is. A few moments later. What is up everyone? Welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, as you can see by this very cringy intro, we are reviewing the Cardi B collaboration with Fashion Nova. I have been waiting for this day for probably like three or four months ever since I found out about this collaboration and that it was happening. I was so ready for it. And when it came to the day, I realized that the UK and the US are not synchronized. The time difference was just so crazy. I literally had to stay up till four in the morning just to buy the collaboration. How sad is that? But I honestly just really wanted to review this for you guys because I feel like it's such a huge thing in the Fashion Nova history. Like they have never really collaborated with anyone and I love a bit of Cardi B. Like she is one of my favorite rap artists. So I thought this would be great to do because I'm sure a lot of you guys are also Cardi B fans. I know I'm a huge fan of her music. So looking at my email with the order on my laptop, I have actually spent roughly $300 on this collaboration and I only picked up one, two, three, four, five, five pieces, which is kind of pricey. I mean, it definitely hurt my bank just a little bit. Now I've got to say, when this collaboration came out at literally four in the morning in the UK, I was just kind of like sat there like a slug on my laptop, like literally hating my life. In that moment, I noticed that the prices of the collaboration were actually quite high. Now, I don't really know what sort of price point I expected, but I know that Fashion Nova is sort of known for like quite affordable clothing. So when I saw things that were, you know, a little bit more pricey, I was a bit unsure, but I still thought I would pick up a couple of things to you know test it out for you guys see if it's worth the money the whole collab that they did was kind of like you know meant to be a bit more bougie a little bit more high-end but also quite inexpensive but I don't know you guys be the judge I mean I think some of the prices are a little bit too much to say the least but we're gonna see together if it's worth the money so if you guys enjoy this video make sure you smash that huge thumbs up just down below don't forget to come and join the dinosaur family by subscribing as well and I've also done this sort of video but with Kylie Jenner's clothing twice already so I will also link them down below and in the eye in the corner but if you guys want to see what I picked up from the Cardi B collab with Fashion Nova then let's get on into the video okay Okay, so I have my big Fashion Nova bag right here. Now, I've got to say that this order actually took a lot longer than I thought it would come. Most Fashion Nova orders that I do, living in the UK obviously, do actually come pretty quick, probably like a week. However, for this one I had to wait two weeks and it's probably just because of the high demand, the fact that it's a collab with, you know, a celebrity. I guess that kind of justifies waiting two weeks for this to come. So I'm literally just going to crack it open, we're going to have a little look on what's inside. Okay, so so the first item I have picked out is this right here. Now this is the exact uh, two piece that Cardi B wore to her launch party. If you guys don't know, she actually had like a whole launch party that was live streamed on the Fashion Nova website. And she was wearing this. I mean, when I was literally watching it at four in the morning, I saw her wear it. So I was like, okay, I need that one. So this set is called the Check and Resume Tweed Matching Set in black and white. Now this thing right here was $89.99. So I mean that kind of just gives you a little flavor of you know what's to come I feel like that is definitely a little bit on the expensive side, but I don't want to be too judgmental I just kind of want to open it see what the quality is like see if it's actually worth it. So this is it We have a ooh. Something has just dropped. What in the world is this? I'm guessing it's just like extra buttons. That's pretty cool. So first up we have the kind of like cropped blazer. I actually really like this. It's giving me very like Chanel vibes. So good job Fashion Nova so far. I mean, it looks great. I love the oversized buttons. The quality seems like actually quite sturdy, really nice and thick. So you know, it looks all right so far. And then we have the skirt, which looks like this. Now, again, it's got the same sort of tweed pattern to it. It's got the buttons, which are quite oversized. And my favorite part is that it actually has... Okay, no, it doesn't have pockets. <laughs> 
<laughs> Disappointment. <laughs> Honestly, I was so happy. I thought this actually had real pockets, but these are just fake pockets, which that's not cool, Cardi. Come on. You could have put real pockets on this. It has got a zipper at the back to kind of get into the skirt, but yeah, I mean, I've got to be honest, the skirt, I can just tell right off the bat that it's not going to fit me very well because it's just like... I don't know, it just looks like a box. It looks like it's just going to go straight down. It hasn't really got too much shape and my waist is kind of a lot smaller than my hips, so we'll see. Also, this little bit of hair is really annoying me. <laughs> I also just quickly want to point out that I don't want to be like 100% harsh, but I definitely want to be like subjective and just let you guys know how I feel about this clothing because at the end of the day, it is $89.99 for this little set. And although I love Cardi B as an artist, I definitely don't want that to cloud my judgment on the actual clothing. So let's pop this bad boy on and see how it looks. Okay, so this is what this little number looks like on. I am actually really digging it. It's kind of giving me like clueless vibes, but I do have to say that I suspected it is kind of large around my sort of waistline. It's just a little bit too like baggy. Like there's just a lot of space right here, which is kind of annoying, but obviously there's different shapes and sizes to everyone. So I feel like, you know, it might not work for me, but it might work for someone else. I could always potentially like cinch it in at the waist and tailor it myself. But at the same time, you know, when you're paying $89.99 on Fashion Nova for something like this, you kind of want it to fit you without having to tailor it. These buttons do feel a tad bit loose. So I don't know how long they're actually gonna stay on. However, they did give you some extra buttons in case you lose one. So that's really good. I'm just looking in the mirror and it actually is really cute it is a shame that it's just a little bit too like wide around the waist but you know I still actually really like it I probably would still wear this and the one downside is of course the fact that it doesn't have pockets like I'm honestly heartbroken about that because that would have just been so cool but overall I think this is a really good quality sort of set um it is a little bit pricey still in my opinion for what it is but at the same time you are paying for the Cardi B collab so I feel like you know they have to make their money somewhere but overall I am a big fan I mean there's some things that I don't really like such as you know the fit of the skirt however as an overall sort of outfit Outfit. It still looks really cute. I could make it work. So I'm gonna give this one a thumbs up Okay, the next item we have is this now This is the red dress that she was kind of wearing on the cover photo of the whole like collab before it even came out So I was like already eyeing that up as well. This was actually at $49.99 Let's crack it open and let me show you what it looks like this I have a feeling I'm actually gonna really like because I already can tell that this is really well made like the quality of the fabric is just so nice. It's basically just like a high neck dress um, made out of this sort of like velvety fabric, but not exactly. It just kind of feels really like plushy and just nice to the touch. This does actually have some padding on the actual shoulders to kind of give it a little bit more structure. And then as you kind of come down the dress, we have this really cool belt sort of detail where you can tie it up and you know, it just kind of cinches you in at the waist. And I feel like that's a really cool addition to the dress. This is called the Bougie Bad and Thick Dress in burgundy. I don't know if they actually have different colors of this, but I just decided to pick up this one since Cardi B was wearing it. I'll insert a photo right here. I actually quite like that this dress is kind of fancy, but it's got like kind of like hoodie sort of elements to it. It's kind of got the sort of hoodie type of sleeve to it, which is definitely really different for a dress that has like shoulder pads. So for $49.99, I feel like a dress of this sort of quality is actually worth it. But of course, we're gonna see how this looks on. So let's try it on. Okay, this is the next one. Who is she? Who is she? Honestly, I've got to say I'm low key obsessed with this one. It is definitely a lot more like serious businesswoman vibes for me, but I'm kind of living for it. The second I put this dress on, I honestly felt like I was ready for Christmas. I guess it's because of the color. Like it's such a nice wine red. And I also really love the fabric. It's really nice and soft. I really like the structure of this dress. I like the fact that it's kind of got like ribbing all the way down the dress. Everything about this dress is so well put together. I feel like the dress is kind of top heavy. I mean, it's got like the shoulder pads, the big like bell sort of sleeves, but it still somehow really works. And for £50, yeah, it is still expensive, but I feel like you're getting a lot more for your money than you were with the set beforehand because this, it's like, you can't really get this anywhere else. This sort of dress is very unique. I haven't really seen many dresses like this online, but with a tweed set, I feel like you could really get that anywhere pretty much. So already I'm liking this dress a lot more. This is what it looks like from the back. Yeah, I don't really have anything bad to say about it. It's like 
all good for me. Maybe the price could be a little bit lower, but overall it's a super nice dress, so I'm giving this a massive thumbs up. This next item, I just had to laugh when I saw this on the website, and I didn't buy this to kind of take the mic. I just really wanted to see what it would look like on me because I was so intrigued. So the item of clothing in question is this. It kind of looks like tights, right? Wrong. <laughs> it's actually a turtleneck. Would you believe that turtlenecks will look like this in 2018? Honestly, when I saw this at four in the morning, I didn't know whether to laugh or cry. I mean, this is definitely something else. Um, the way you're supposed to wear it is kind of like, it's got this turtleneck sort of element to it. And then you're meant to wear it. I don't even understand. Okay, so you're meant to put your arm through here. And then this is like the sleeve. Does that make sense? It's a really strange piece of clothing. I've never seen anything like this before. And this thing right here was $29.99. So almost $30, you guys, for like basically a scarf. But I still picked it up because, you know, I wanted to try it for you guys. So let's pop it on and see how it looks. Okay, so I'm not gonna lie with this one. I had no idea what to pair it with. So I'm literally just wearing a white shirt and also some jeans and we're just gonna, we're just gonna pop this on and see if we can make this work. I honestly don't know how this is gonna look. It's probably just gonna look ridiculous, but um, let's try it on. Am I wearing this back to front? How can you even tell? Okay, so I'm putting my sleeve on. <laughs> there's one, and there's two. Okay, this is, this is it. This is the look, guys. Okay, am I fashionable yet? <laughs> Does this look good or does it look horrible? I mean, to me, I just feel like this looks horrendous, but I don't know. Who am I to judge? Okay, so there's a lot of the turtleneck fabric. Like, it's just kind of all bunching up. I don't know what to do with it. Now, with the actual top that I'm wearing underneath, in the photo on the website, the model was wearing kind of like a boob tube and then this. So maybe it would look better with a boob tube, but at the same time, my pits are so exposed. <laughs> like... <laughs> why? Like, why am I doing this to myself? The sleeves are also quite flared. They're not like bell sleeves, but they're just like flared. I don't know. Do I like that? I feel like whenever I wear flared sleeves, I always just like randomly dip it in things by accident. Like if I'm eating a bowl of soup, I'll just like dip my sleeve in and it's just not a good time. So I don't know how I feel about these sleeves and just about this whole sweater situation. <laughs> it's definitely a lot. Like, is this a look? Do I look like a snack yet? I think I'm gonna have to give this one a thumbs down. I just don't think this is working for me, you guys. Like, there's just... It's a no from me. <laughs> the next item of clothing I picked up was actually kind of like a bodysuit. This one was, again, a little bit more on the pricey side. This was $49.99, but I just felt like it was very different. I've never seen anything like this before, so I had to get it. So this is called the Money Bag Bodysuit. This is what it looks like. It is so extra. Like, can we just take a moment for this? The sleeves are literally everything. It's got zippers. It's got, like, the whole cutout thing. It's off the shoulders. Literally, what more could you want in one bodysuit? Kind of gives me like Lady Gaga vibes from 2014, but I was just very intrigued. I mean, I feel like this might be a tad revealing. I don't know how it's gonna look on me, but I just thought I'd give it a shot. So let's pop it on and see how this fits. Okay, so this is the body. I honestly kind of like it. I have to admit, it's not really something I would usually wear. Like there's a lot of like boobage out at the moment, so I'm kind of covering up. But I really like this, you know, like it just fits really nicely. It's got like the crotchy snappy thing. So like you can snap it at the crotch so it doesn't rise up, which is really good. The sleeves are really interesting. They kind of have like a poofy thing on the top. This kind of gives me like princess vibes, but like trap queen edition. <laughs> I probably wouldn't wear this out myself, but I do really appreciate it and I do really like it as a piece of clothing. Perhaps if I was a little bit more confident, I would probably wear this. Okay, so the very last item of the video is another plaid set. Now this is actually like a blazer and trousers. This one was again a little bit pricey. This one was $89.99. So again, kind of on the pricey side, I'm not gonna lie, but we're gonna judge it together. We're gonna see how it looks. This is the pair of trousers. Now this is actually really interesting because I didn't realize that this would be kind of like um, 
vinyl sort of fabric. It feels very like slippery. It kind of feels like faux leather. And it's got a really cool like snake sort of faux snake print to it. So right off the bat, this isn't really the type of thing that I would normally wear. Like the actual trouser leg is flared. So, you know, Cardi B's trying to bring the flares back. I mean, they're kind of already back, but I just didn't really jump on that train, you know? And then the actual blazer looks like this. It's basically got the same pattern. Um, oh, I feel some shoulder pads again. She has actually gone ham with the shoulder pads, you guys. But this is what it looks like. It looks very bougie. It's kind of got like this faux gold chain sort of trim all the way around. And even actually on the sleeves, which is kind of cute. I've got to say, I kind of like this. I'm not sure where exactly I would wear this type of thing, but it looks quite cute. So let's give it a shot. Oh my God, this is what I'm talking about. This is honestly such a cute little outfit. I love the fact that even though it's quite out there, it's still kind of wearable. Like I don't usually wear stuff like this and I honestly would wear this out, which definitely says a lot because it is, you know, plaid like it's literally a plaid set and on top of that it's bloody flared like it's got flares as for the quality of this like i said it feels really nice it's kind of got like a nice um soft lining rather than having like this really cold sort of fabric on the inside as well which is great i love the trimming which is like the metal thing around the cuffs and also around this here the only thing i'm kind of missing is a button i think it would be quite nice with a button but at the same time you could add one yourself if you've really wanted one as for the trousers they actually actually fit really nicely as well. I think they're really body hugging. And although these trousers didn't actually have a zipper, the waistband is really nice and stretchy. So I did manage to get my hips through it, which is really good. Now with this outfit, what I like about it is that even if you don't go for, you know, the whole thing, you can still just rock the trousers or just the blazer. And it's really versatile. You can make it, you know, a lot more wearable like that. I think my favorite part of the whole outfit is definitely the trousers. They just fit so well. I'm definitely going to give this one a thumbs up as well. So those are all of the pieces that I'm gonna try out for you guys from the Cardi B X Fashion Nova collaboration. I do actually have to say that I did actually order two other items that didn't actually come, which is so annoying. I actually got an email a couple of days back and they were like, sorry, these items are out of stock. Basically, we've sent you a refund, which is obviously great, but like, I did actually want the items for this video. The ones I actually purchased was the She Bad Maxi dress, which is right here, and also the Okr top. <laughs> so I honestly was so excited to get those and I was so gutted when it didn't come. I was like, no. So I was honestly like, why me? I thought I was one of the first people to order it because I literally stayed up all night just to get those things. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this little video. I had so much fun reviewing these things and I probably will keep some of them. I mean, this one right here is definitely going back. I just don't think I could ever make use of something like this. I mean, it's just not for me, but let me know what you guys think of this. Would you wear this turtleneck? Let me know down below which one of these items was your your favorite would you wear them i think my favorite was definitely kind of like the two piece if you guys would like to see more videos like this in the future let me know what other like collaborations you'd want me to review or if there's any websites you'd like me to try out for clothing online then also let me know in the comments below i love to hear your suggestions for videos if you haven't already seen the videos where i tried out kylie jenner's clothing from fashion nova i will also link them down below and also in the eyes so make sure you guys check it out after this video but that is all from me thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys in my next video. Bye! Mwah.